What's up everyone and welcome back to Rob's Gaming Table. Today on the table we're doing another Gloomhaven scenario. This time it's number 40, Ancient Defense Network. Uh, if you haven't seen any of our previous playthroughs, check them out at a playlist in at Rob's Gaming Table on YouTube. I am Rob, this is my wife Melanie. We're playing some spoiler classes, non-starter classes, so if you don't want to know what they are, tune away, it's three spears and the squid face, you've been warned. Uh, we are going to be spoiling uh, scenario 40, but we will not spoil road events or city events. Uh, so yeah, I think that is it. Let's get to it. Um, requirements, the Voices Party uh, Command Party or the Voices Treasure Party and the Voices Treasure Party complete, which we have. Uh, the goal is to occupy both pressure plates, A, simultaneously, which we'll find those eventually. Uh, and introduction. There is but one vessel left, the voice calls to you. We're so very close. The last group that worked to imprison me was a guild of humans who have long since passed from this earth. Even their graves were no longer known in this time. But I know all, I know all. Visions of a tomb fill your head. This is, it is rife with traps and other deadly instruments. You somehow have knowledge of how to find it deep under the Eastern Copernix. The vessel is buried within the head of the guild in the tomb designed to kill all those. Next page. <laughs> Foolish enough to enter, the voice says. This will be your most difficult task before you can even enter the tomb. You will have to disable the defense network built around it. I can show you the way inside. Once there, you'll need to split up and simultaneously activate a series of switches in opposite sides of this gauntlet of pain. They thought they could hide their secrets from me, but they were mistaken. Sure enough, you're able to find the entrance of the tomb in a cave under the mountains. You drop down into the ruins and a blaring alarm immediately fills the room. The whole expanse before you lights up in red and a number of mummified corpses at your feet begin to stir and rise. Special rules, add three minus one cards to each character's attack modifier deck as a scenario effect. I added them to mine. Mel has the, the perk that blocks it, so she doesn't have to do it. Mm -hmm. And it seems like the next thing we read is the conclusion. So we will stop there. All right. So the only other thing would be the bless that we got from the event. Yes, road event gave us a bless. That's did the only thing. That? Yeah, that's the one thing. Gave us one each in our deck. I did not donate. Did you? Uh, no, I didn't. Nope. Did not donate either. Um, so first room. Uh, we can start at any of these, either the center hex or anything surrounding that center hex. These uh, poison. Uh, oh, they are poison and stun traps. Okay. So the no damage, just poison and stun. So that sucks. Um, but they're not in the way. Nope. Um, the other thing was it talked about splitting up. Yeah. To go to the pressure plates. So I'm assuming one will be on one end, one will <coughs> be on the other end. Yes, yeah, correct. So. Um, so this this will be the first mission that we'll have to kind of play solo. Yeah. So I think uh, pressure plate here because uh, it goes this way. This yep. is a wall here. Uh, I looked it up in the FAQ to make sure that it wasn't goofed up. Because it looks like it kind of goes through. But there's like that dark border, which indicates it's a wall. And it's only connected room if there's a tile overlaying it or a door. Okay. So this way is a dead end. And this way is a dead end. Now this way... Looks way longer. Is much longer. One, two, three. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. Let's say it's the back. Yeah, so we've corrected the door tile uh, that was missing from up here when we set it up. Uh, so this way is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, let's say. So that way is definitely, this way is the longer way, this way is the shorter way. I think I have more movement in my deck. Yeah. Plus I have the blinking cape. Yep. Yeah. That I used in the last mission to move forward with a jump. We both have boots, so yep. that can help us. Yep. But it says occupy both pressure plates simultaneously and is the goal. No killing enemies. I wonder like if the other way is more enemy like heavy enemies. because it takes longer to get there. But yeah. that's fine. I think I'm going to try that. Yeah, so we predetermined we set up our characters here. We, we kind of figured this is a longer way. So I'm going to go this way. You're going to go this way. We'll take a try at it. Yep. And figure it out. So we got living corpses in here. They are level four. We're playing this at level four, obviously. Uh, the fact that they're level four. Uh, they are all regular. Four of them in the room here. Poison, stun traps, like I said. Uh, so these living corpses, 11 uh, health, two movement, four attack, no range. And yeah, let's. Okay. 
figure out what we're doing here. So I think I'm going to try to take some shots at them before moving. I just don't want to waste boots jumping. If they don't move, I don't want to be wasting my boots already. Right. Because you. Because yeah. I have a feeling I won't be able to really get those boots back too easily. I don't want to long rest surrounded by enemies. Yeah, they're not. Especially being by big, myself. They're not big rooms either. They're tight. So. Yeah. And 11 health after the last mission is not the craziest. They don't have shields or anything. I'm assuming they're slow, if I remember correctly, but... Yeah, I think so, too. It's been a while since we played with the living corpses. Yeah. All right. Yep. Uh, 44. 27. 47. Move, plus one, attack, minus one. Okay, so I'm first with 27. So they're moving up to three if they want, and then they're attacking for three. Yeah. Okay, that's uh, not... That's a not good. Okay. So, for, first I'm going to do this... Attack of two. Oh. Attack two, range four, targeting two. Yeah. Does it want experience? Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah. I thought I played a different card, but that's fine. Uh, so let's do number two first. Okay. Okay, so attack of two. Yeah. Two. Two. These on guys two. have no shields. Okay, and now on number four, on uh, number six, attack of two, three. Nice. Okay, uh, number six. Uh, I got one experience for that. Then on the bottom here, I have an attack of three. So let's attack number six, who has more damage on him. So attack of three. Three more. So he's at six. Okay. All right. Uh, 44. Okay. I will... I think I'm going to do one, two, three, four. So it's Hawk Helm during a range attack at plus one range. Three, four. Four. Oh. Six is at. You don't want to worry about the guys in front of you? Yeah, I just worry about you taking more hits. You have less health. Mm. And you didn't, like, you're going to take two hits of six, or two hits of three right now. I'm going to take two hits of three. I have 24 health. What are you at? 13. Yes, that's a problem. All right, so I am going to add a range. I mean, I'll try. I'm just going to shoot a fiver at number six here. One, two, three, four. So I've okay. added the range uh, and generate sun. And it's going to muddle him. So if he doesn't die, he will. Uh, then it's a no. Oh, of course it is. Wow. Of course it is. Okay. So in that case, I'm going to. Attack two at range four, and let's immobilize the other guy because I want the guy with muddle to hit you. Sure. One, two, three, four. Uh, so he's immobilized. Oh, he's oh, also he's muddled. muddled too. Thanks. So it doesn't matter. Then plus two, so it's actually a hit of four. Four on number two, so yeah, he's at so six. He's six. So they're both six and muddled. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> okay, now these guys are going to go. So number one will go first. He can move of three. Okay. So he'll just move one up to you. Attack of three. Two. Two, not bad. Down to 22. Okay, okay now number two is immobilized. Sorry, did you say? Um, I didn't put the mobilized. Yeah. Okay, so number two is immobilized, so he can't. So it's gone. That's fine. Yeah, the middle's gone. Okay. And number uh, four. Okay. Four. Uh, down 18. Okay. Okay, and now number six. And he is muddled, so it's plus one or plus one. So it is a four. One, two, That's three, four. And his muddle is gone. Okay, but now they're not in the doorway. I don't know if I just keep running. <laughs> but then I'm gonna yeah, yeah that's the thing now that they're out of the way but yeah because those guys are slow yeah that's usually the thing. We can just get away from them hmm okay so elements and shuffles okay good 10 21 66 oh, you've been attacking you are first uh, okay so I'll attack five gain experience on doesn't matter no it might uh i'll do number four 
six times Ooh, two. Ooh, 12, matter. he's dead. Yep. Well, that meant that they both didn't have any damage. Yeah, I know. But I thought maybe if I get lucky, like, I'll roll a roll and something. Like that. That's better than I thought it would be. That's perfect. But I thought maybe I get lucky where, yeah, I just, if I kill him, it's easy to oh, move. I, I guess I kill him, it's easy to move out, too, but... I don't know. I just hate going around them. Yeah. Uh, okay. So that is that card played. Uh, then I'll move three shield to self for the rest of the round. And we will spawn the room. All right. So we got the room spawned up. And the map corrected. We noticed it was a little wonky from <laughs> the setup. Funny. <laughs> so we've uh, corrected this room. It was just attached to the wrong uh, thing. And then it drew everything else off. We got it corrected. We got a regular cave bear. Uh, we got an elite forest imp. Uh, two regular forest imps. We have these little nests, which are obstacles. Then we got these uh, damage traps across here, which are six damage. And that is it for this room. So, uh, yeah, I'm just shielding myself. I've done my turn. So the... Cave Bear has a move minus one, attack minus one with a mobilize. Oh, oh boy. He moves for four, so that gives him a three move. 14, and then Imp. Uh, they do move minus one, attack plus one. Ugh. And the Elite curses and has shield two. two. The other guy's shield two. Yeah. Flying. Okay. Um, hmm. Interesting. Well, you have shield two, which will hopefully protect you a little bit. A little bit. But I'm going to get a mobilize. But yeah, and then you'll be stuck there. Yeah, you will. Yeah, that does suck. Okay, so that's, so that's my it turn. For you? Okay, yeah. Cave Bear next, so you can move up three. One, two, three. And he's going to attack you for three, four. Four, wow. Okay. Uh, oh, shield two. Yep, so two. One, two. And immobilize. And immobilize, thanks, buddy. Okay, and now me. I'm going to do, I'm 21. I'm going to do an attack of four, range three, and curse. I'll do number two, which is the one closest to the door up there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so attack of four. Just four. Uh, number two. And curse their oh, deck. Oh, one away from dying, really? Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, and then I'm going to do a move of two and shield myself for one. So let's do one, two. Um... And on my turn, I'm going to heal myself for three. One, two, three. Okay. Uh, that was me. Uh, corpses. So corpse number one can do a move of two. So just a move of one to you. And he's attacking you for four. Three. So, so, two, just so just one. Down to okay, now these guys up here. Number two. Oh, he's going to move right in my way. You bugger. I should have moved the other way. My ding dong. Okay, so if you can move number two. Right up here? Yep. And he's going to attack me for four. I have a shield of one. So I'm only taking three. Oh, wow. One, two, three. And then the other guy is going to attack me for four. Three, two, take two. Okay, imps, <coughs> excuse me. They have range of four and can move of three. Okay. So. One, one two, two, three, three, three four. Yeah, so you just move, move up one. Yep. Uh, I can fly. So. Yep. Four, yep. Okay, and attacking you for three, four, five. Minus two shields, so three. Uh, okay. Okay, number four. <laughs> Guy number four. Yep. Uh, uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah. Okay, and he's attacking you for three. Mine, one, so, so one. one. Down to 11. And then I don't think this guy will get you in the bottom, but he can move of four. Uh, can't go any further. And he can't get you from yeah. there, okay. so that's good. Great. That's it. All right, so elements and shuffles. This one might be harder than we thought. Yep. So what I'm thinking is, uh, yeah, like staying and fighting in that middle room might not have been a bad idea. And then like opening each other's doors and then like fighting whatever comes at us and then leaving the middle room and trying to go Maybe. and just rush the last two rooms of enemies. 
but I don't know. Because the bear moves fast, these guys move fast, so how much I can't outrun them ever, and I can't have them all hitting me every turn. So you have to like stand and fight at some point. So you think so far based on what we've seen, open this door, stand and fight together, and then me go? Or open the other door. Like we we just stand our ground, kill whichever ones first. Yeah. Kill the other ones first, then pick a door, open the door, fight whatever comes at us. Maybe open the other door at the same time, I don't know, but I feel like standing our ground in that first room for a while might have been the best idea. I'm good. You good? Yep. All right. 17. 37. 37. Three. Yeah, this bear's way too fast. Oh, he's not going to attack. Still way too fast. And 47. Okay, so three. He is now shield one, retaliate two, heal self. Right. But there's nothing to heal. Great. Okay, and 17 is next. Okay, I can't move, so I'm going to just shield oneself for the rest of the turn. Um, and I will heal five, gain experience. So I'm up to 16 health, and I lose my mobilize. And do I want to get any cards back? So, yeah, I'll take three cards back. So, three. Yeah. Three cards back with my major stamina potion. Okay. Okay. Uh, that's it. Okay, so now it's me. So I can come down there and attack some of those guys for you. Now the only problem is I will not be initiative. Like even if I'm right beside him, you're still initiative because you went before me. Mm -hmm. But you want me to just come down there and start attacking some of them? Mm. Okay, what are they going to do? So this uh, guy is going to attack for three on me. The bear's not doing anything. He's already gone. And just these the little imps. fairies are going to attack you for two each. That's fine. Just do what you got to do up there. Do what I'm going to do yep. up there. Just work towards your pressure plate. Okay. I think that's the best call. Okay. Get your room open, so get through it. I'm going to do a move of three and shield oneself. So if you could just move me one, two, three, like that way. One, one two, two three. three. Yep. Okay. And then no I'm. jump? You don't want to boot it up? No, not yet. I don't know what's in these other rooms. Uh, shield one. And then attack a four, range three, generate wind. And I'll do it on this guy that's almost dead. Okay. Okay, so on number two, pack of four. Cursing. So that's good. It goes in either way, right? Uh, or no. no. It just adds it to the attack. Oh, okay. Poison. And, oh, times two. We yeah. only need one to die. I was going to stage it on the other guy because the other guy only needed five to die. It doesn't matter. I still just wanted to get rid of one of them. So, yeah. okay. So then number two is dead. I get a health for my teeth. This doesn't, doesn't go in. Yeah, uh, that'll get shuffled after that, and now I have shield one for that guy. Okay. Uh, now the imps are thirty-seven. Should have attacked first, then moved. But I didn't want to be disadvantaged. Still, he's only had a, like a couple hits left. Your attack before. Oh, I see. Whatever. Yeah, just because then now you could move and you'd be like right on the door. Yeah. I see. Okay. That's okay. Just for a future. Yeah. I was thinking of disadvantage, which I guess wouldn't have really mattered because it was all rolling, rolling in yeah. turns too. So, um, okay, imps are gonna go. So elite imp is range of four. Yeah, he's good. He's good. He's attacking you for two. Yeah. Nothing. But he curses. Yeah. Which we got last time. I did shuffle into my deck after. Okay. Uh... So I got tons of minus ones in here. A couple curses. Got my null card. It's great. All great. All right, fairy number four. One, two, three, four. She's already four away from you. Attack a two. So just attack a two. So you take one. Okay. Not and bad. then the other fairy is going to have to move. She can move a four, so she'll just jump over. One, two, and then she's going to attack you for two, three. So you take two. One, two. And okay. then the corpse. 
Number so one. number one, he's attacking for minus one. So three, three. So you take two. two. And now he, that, that guy's attacking me for three, two, shield one. So I just take one. Nice. Okay. And that's it. Okay. Elements and shuffles. Alright. Good. 26. 61. 43. 61. And 71. Uh, so Bear's doing some moving, kind of weak attack, but he's looking to target two people. I don't think it's happening. No. Living Corpse is moving some extra attack and poisoning all adjacent enemies so we can get beside somebody. And be there for 71. The imps are only attacking for one, but they're cursing. Of course. Great. Okay. You're first. 26, really? Yep. Yep. Okay, nice. That worked out. Okay. So I will move five with some boots. One, two, three, four, five. Then I will attack in a little row with this red hex business, get oh, new experience. Sweet. It's only attack three. That's and okay. Shield two on both of them. Yeah. So I will, but I have pierce, rolling pierces, so maybe, yeah. uh, but it never works out, rarely. Uh, so the first guy, two. Uh, Four. So five. So he blocks attack three plus two. Oh, yeah. Five, shield, so three gets through, so he has four left to die. Three on number two. Okay, and then the other guy behind him, number six, three. There's the pierce. There's the pierce. Jeez. So right now he's gonna die. There you go. He's dead. Boom. Okay. So that one comes off. Okay, that's one less curse you're gonna get. No way. <laughs> <laughs> uh, then I'm going to during my turn perform a move for jump action with my blinking cape. Blinking your one, die. two, three, four. Wow. Now the bear has to cross the traps, but he won't because he'll go for you. Sorry. That's okay. That's okay. I'm not going to be there. All right. So 43 is next. So imps are next. So elite imp has a range of four and can move a four. So one, two, three, four. So he needs to go here. Can't see it. One, oh. oh, actually here. Two. two. Yeah. One, two, three. Yeah. Yeah. And well, this actually is range. Oh, okay. One, two, three, four. Yeah. Okay. And he is going to attack you for one. Nothing. Great. But That's the perfect enemy I want to see a null card on. He has curse and the card has curse. Okay. Nice. Two more curses. So I think it's four in my deck now. Okay. Woo -woo. I don't know if you want to wait one more because you're going to get yeah, one sure. more here. Just so pass it up. I'll keep shuffling. This guy needs to be <laughs> one, two, three, four. So one, two, or one, whatever. Yeah. And he's attacking you for one, one. And cursing. Oh, I'm so sorry. I think I may have given you the monster ones. If you could just, while well, you're shuffling anyways, just double what check. Is it? I gave you the monster ones instead. Oh, yeah, because we can only have a certain amount, right? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I thought so. Sorry. It's habit. Just on those last two, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, sorry. Okay. Okay, so bear 61 and I'm 61, so I'll go first. So I have a move of four. So I'm so sorry, I have to do oh, yeah, yeah. one, two. And we can spawn the next room. Okay, let's do it. All right, so the room spawned up. Uh, we got an elite bear at the far back there. Uh, and you're on the door space. Okay, and I have two more moves. Because I had a move of four. So All one, right. two. All so right. Where's that other door? Go, go, go. Uh, What's the bear going to do? Bear is moving a five if he wants because he's elite. Yeah. And, and then he will attack for four and throwing a wound on you. Right. So, I don't think you can get out of that movement because he one, is two. one, two, three, four, and he's up in your face. Okay, but I can move one, two. Yep. So my other two, so that was four. 
And then I, so that's that. Mm -hmm. And now I can do an attack of three, range three, and curse on the bear. Sure, yeah. Put so some curses in their deck. Attack of three. Five. Nice. That's okay. That's okay. Just on... need 16 more to die. <laughs> okay. And <laughs> curse. That's fine. Hopefully these will help. We're going to have to show. Oh, yeah. Never mind. You're right. Um, okay. And then on my turn, I'm going to actually recover five cards. Three for my major and two for my minor. Good. Nice something to pitch when you get attacked. Well, I maybe. And hopefully you get your moves back and you can yeah. keep going because I definitely want that move before again. You're not far away from the final move removal. Move four. Move five. And let's take a good attack, I guess. Attack of four. Okay. Nope, oh, that's only four. One, two, three, four. I can take one more. Let's do. Move and shield, just in case. Okay, so that's my five. Okay. So the cave bear. So the elite cave bear is just going to come towards me. And he can move of five. If you Can you reach to move him to me? Yep. Sorry. Okay, he's attacking me for four. Oh, five, five six. six. I only have seven. And so you're now, I'm Yeah, I'm going to pitch a card for that. Yeah, that seems like a legit card pitch. I don't want to... Okay. So now the bear down here, who is closer right now because of the traps, he comes to me? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so he's not going to go over traps. He'll just turn the other way because there's somebody on the other side okay, of them. So he can move a four. One, two, three, four. Okay. Uh, and then 71, the corpse. So there's number one. Number one can move of two. Uh, one, two. And the other guy can move too, so he just stands on the door. Two. Okay, and that's it. Okay. Okay, and shuffles. All right, All right we're good. Yep. 26. 99. Decide the long rest. I need to get my boots going. I need my hawk helm. Get some health back. More. So 76, 34. And 66. Okay, this is not terrible for me. Okay. Okay. So as long as you're not beside the bear at yes, 34. Yes, because you're not I'm first. Get attacked. Okay. Are you first? Take a wound. Yes, take a wound. Thank you. Down to six. Okay. I'm going to do a move of three and shield myself one. Okay. So, a door, I assume? Yes. All right, let's spawn up the room and see what we get. Okay. So the room is spawned up. We have uh, hazardous terrain, which is orange border lava here, which damages you for three every time you move on it, based on the, like half our trap damage rounded down, which our trap damage is six right now. So it's it, but it doesn't stun you or stop you or anything like that. It just hurts you as you enter each hex. It doesn't hurt you starting your turn on it or leaving it. Um, and then we have a regular flame demon which is 30 initiative he will consume the fire which isn't there and he's got a move plus zero attack minus two thrown out wounds targeting two people and they're flying uh he has retaliate three at range two shield three three health four move three attack four range so he's a beast yeah okay so i'm clearly not moving anymore because uh, i only moved one to get there so you have two more moves though right yeah, but I'm not. You don't want to take six damage. No. Moving. No. Yeah, it's too late to use your boots. No. So. so you're not gonna get hit by the bear, but you're gonna get hit by the flame demon. And right. The living corpses can only move two, so you're not getting hit by him. Okay, so and right. Other bear is not moving yet. Right. So, so I think you're, that's you're why. Kind I was... of safe. For yeah. Now. Okay. So I think I'm just gonna attack back at the cave bear for four and be able to throw another curse you in there. You don't want to try to hit the guy. No, because he has be... retaliate. Oh, at range two, yes, you're yeah, right. and, yes, you're and right. he has three shields, so I'd have to get. Yeah. Well, I could make it a plus, but then I have to get a plus one to kill him. Yeah, that's mm. possible. Yeah, so I could attack for five. Attack for five. Yes, shield of three. Three and, and health of three. Right. So you need so six need... total to kill him. I would him. just need a plus one. 
And he retaliates back for what? Three? Yeah. And I have six health. Could pitch a card for it, but that's rough. Uh, it's a gamble. It is a gamble. You just need a plus one or better, right? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what to tell you. You could roll right or your I, null. Yeah. yeah. You could get a minus one and get a zero. I know I'm going to kick myself when it is a something, but I think I have to go for the bear. I can't. I don't know. Bear, but I, yeah. Yeah, I think I'm still going to do a plus one to make it a five. Because yeah. he doesn't have shields. Okay. Oh, well, yeah, because once I go on I the other side. I say you gamble on the other guy, then, if you're going to use up that, that okay. potion and okay, stuff. Okay, let's do it. Or don't use the potion and then just take a regular shot at the other guy. No, I want to use the potion so it's a five, so I need, because my plus two is right here. And you may not get a curse in the deck. That's fine. If he doesn't die, you get a curse in the deck, and you get hit for three. If he dies, you don't have to deal with him hitting you at all. Exactly, then I'm safe this round. But he could still hit you on top of the retaliation. So this could go very bad. Right, and that's why I'm thinking yeah. maybe I should just go for the bear. So then you'll be taking an attack of... Oh, he's only attacking for one. So Right, and I have shield one. Yeah. And I'm already wounded. So retaliate so. goes through shields. Right. So it's your call. <sighs> this if you is... want to gamble, it's like a Hail Mary, but imagine that guy was dead. Yeah, I'm going to gamble it. Ooh. At least he'll be closer to death. Yeah, maybe, if I can get anything maybe, through, yeah. Maybe get a null. All right, we're going for it. it. Yeah, so I did my plus one. So I'm attacking for five. I need a plus one. I'm going to stun him. him. Yes. Okay, even if I miss now, I'm fine. Yeah, stun is sweet. Minus one. <laughs> uh, at least attack Okay, so he is stunned, but let's hold on. So what did I, I attack? So it was attack so it was of a four. Five, minus one. So it's a four. Then shielding of three, one gets through. One gets through. So he only needs two more to die. <laughs> and he's stunned, so he's not going to attack me, but he's going to retaliate me you, right so you now. Take three damage unless you drop a. Yeah, I'll take three damage. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, well, it's not going to attack me, so that's good. It's closer to death, so I mean, if you do another attack like that and get it through. Yeah. But I mean, you just I just got to be farther far, away. Yeah, range three away. Yeah, which most of mine are. Um. Well, yeah, it was three away, but because I'm only two away, yep. I didn't want to move to the bear. Okay. Okay, so that was me. Sorry, that was a long... Yep. Okay, so uh, 30. So the flame demon, he's stunned, so nothing will happen. That goes away. Okay. Uh, the bears will both go. They'll do their attacks. Nobody's there. Big whiff. Okay. Uh, then living, living corpse. corpse. So... They just move two. Yep. One, two. One, two. Okay. And then the imps. So mm -hmm. the elite imp first... He is already in range of four, right? Uh, yep. Yep. So he's going to attack you for plus. Attack you for three. Are you sure? Two. Two. Okay. Down to nine. And then the other guy's going to attack you for three. Nothing. Great. Okay. okay. And you. So that's, and then I will refresh my items. Get to health. Um, do I want to use a health right now? I'll discard a card. Not that, not that. Attack five. One heal. Attack five, I think it is. Yeah, attack five. That's sad, but let's see what she rolls. Uh, and I will heal five, heal three. That's eight. Heal up to 19. Okay. They're good? Those are gone. Yep. Shuffle shuffles. And everything over here. Good? Yep. 10. 37. 43. 49. Okay. 61. And 66. Oops. Okay. Okay. Flame Demon's not moving, no. but he's got a range of four. Oh, no, he's doing a melee attack. So he's only attacking His two, two straight hexes yeah, in front of him. Which I will not be. You which aren't is... right now. No, but I'm going to be going before him, and I'm going to move. Yeah, anyways. just make sure you don't wind up in that. Cave Bear doing some moving of four or five, depending on the bear. It's a little weaker attack. looking can target two, which doesn't matter. Imps are looking to attack for a little less, but they still can move in. Curse again. again. And living corpses are just moving to and attacking, so as long as you're... Sweet. So I'm first, 37. 
right? on 10. Oh, you're 10. So Sorry. I will go first. Sorry. <laughs> Sometimes you put them on the other sides. Yeah, I know. Uh, okay. <laughs> so I'm going to do a move three with shield two. So I'll move one and set up a shield two. And we'll spawn the room here. All right. So we got the room spawned up here. We got three six damage traps creating a border again, similar to this one here. Oh we got two more living corpses, which that sucks because they're... Right moving there. two and attacking like I just, just talked about. I still have two movement and shield two. So I mean, I, if you're, you're going to get, get attacked anyway, anyways, yeah. might as well move closer. Yeah. Alright, does any one of them, I guess this way. Yeah, three move with a jump. I could get over there. I could pitch a card for hitting the trap. I don't know. Anyways, uh, so I'll shield two self. Um, I'm going to then I meant to attack before moving to shoot one of these guys, duh, okay. but that's oh, fine. But yeah, you've opened the door now. Yeah, I'll shoot. Um, I just realized that. Uh, I'll just shoot. Maybe I get lucky. If it's like a rolling and a times two, so that'd be the best. But anyways, I'll shoot the guy right beside me. With disadvantage? Oh, they're going to both hit me anyway. So I'll just shoot this guy. Yeah. Yeah, maybe some Yeah, because then you don't have disadvantage. Yeah, but disadvantage with lots of rolling in my deck is not the worst, but... Well, uh, but you need the one plus. Yeah, but I'm going to roll into a curse. Like, I have so many curses in yeah. here, anyway, so I don't know why I'm thinking about this all too much. Five. Uh, I just refresh and I don't oh. know. That's it. Okay, so but five. So five attack on number five. Okay. All right. Now me. That is me. So I'm going to take a wound to two. Oh, boy. I'm going to do a move of five. I'm going to use my boots to jump over this fire. And I want to be one, one two, two, three, three four. four. No, 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 four. Really? Yeah, because I need to, I only have two. I have a wound. I can't go in that room. I need to get rid yeah, of this okay, guy, okay, hopefully, okay, and then heal sure. myself. Okay. okay, so I'm going to stop there. Then maybe I can rest and get my boots back in case. Now I'm going to do an attack of four, range three, just out of retaliation and create wind. So an attack of four. Cursing. Okay. Poisoning. Okay. And four. So. Shields three of it. One gets through, so he's one away from dying. Okay, poison uh, and. At least next time the poison should help. Poison and curse. Okay. Dang it. Yeah. That's fine, because now I don't want to move, so I can heal myself and then attack him and I'm not in his straight line of attack so that's fine okay so now 43 the imps are gonna go so the elite imp has a range of four one two three four oh. how much move does he have four four but it needs to be in like the doorway. one two three four but I don't think you have a line of sight there no he does not so that's good definitely doesn't okay do then the other imp again can uh, move. A f no, yeah, no, 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 I don't no. think so. Not through the wall. Okay, and then the other imp can move a four as well. One, two, three, four. He is. Yeah, uh, and he's going to attack you for one. And Krisha. So one. Oh, you have shield. Oh, shield too. Yeah. Curse. I want to get cursed. Nice. Yeah. Thanks, buddy. Okay. My deck's half curses now. <laughs> Flame <laughs> demon cannot do anything. Again, we said a straight line. Cannot consume fire, so that's fine. Okay, cave bear. Now where do the cave bears are going? Where are they going to go? If not after me because I'm behind a wall of traps. Yeah, but I have this fire damage. That's not a trap. Okay. That's way less, I, I think. Okay. It it's not a trap. It's a, it's a hundred. And each style. hex they move in, he's going to take three damage? Yeah. Okay. So the bear elite up there can do a move of four. Five, right? Or five, yes, eight. yes, right. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so, so he we takes took, three, uh, six, three, nine. Six, nine, yeah. Six. What's this guy? Nine. Was three. Oh, yeah. So nine plus five so is 14. 14. So I'll put this to a two and you give me two sixes. Okay, oh, now he's going to attack me. That kind of blows. Yep. And wound you again. I'm already wounded. Oh, wounded. You're still wounded. Okay. Yep. Okay. Uh, and he's going to attack me for four. Five. I'm going to pitch a card for that. That's a card pitch, yep. 
Okay. So he's at what? 14, uh, 14 out of 21? Yeah, and now this bear down here can move One, a four. One, two, three, four. Okay. And living corpses. So they're going to do the same thing, I guess. They can come through the fire. You already did this guy. He's just not attacking, yeah. right? Okay. Yeah. Uh, okay, so. So corpse number one down here can do a move of two. One, two. And then. One, uh, number. Oh, I forgot four. there's some down here. Sorry, sorry. He's going to attack me. Four. Four. Shield of two, two so, so two. Down to 17. Then the other guy up, he's just going to. Yep, move up. Four. Minus two, two shields, yeah. nothing. Great. And then that guy up there, move two. One, two on the door. Perfect. That's it. Okay. Elements and truffles. I need a short rest. I need some cards. <laughs> Just need to run into that room. Yeah, but if I die on the thing, we can't win. That is correct. <laughs> <laughs> I can't just be dead there. Yeah, true. So you're going to try to kill those two things? I have to. I think living corpses won't make it across the fire. No, I don't think so. That's fine. Oh, I gotta get rid of this oh, wound yeah, though, so I have to heal myself. The other bear has no damage, so he'll take nine going across it, and he has sixteen. So. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna be totally screwed. So I gotta heal myself. Good. Yep. Twenty-three. Twenty-six. Forty-three. Eight. He's just moving. Three. Three. Trap. Not attacking. Oh, and he's not attacking either. He's just oh, healing. Oh, sweet deal. And 21. Oh, and he's not either. I should have just long rested. Oh, I'm an idiot. I wish no, I knew well, that. No, you never know. I know, All but... the enemies in the room are going to like, take a nap. <laughs> that is so true. That is so true. Okay, so number three first. So the cave bear now has a shield, retaliate of two, and heal two. The okay. other one doesn't he... have anything to heal. And he can move of three. Who? The flame demon? Oh, sorry. Flame demon now. Oh, sorry. Yes. Yeah, I was talking about the other cave Sorry. Bear. You're right. Uh, so move minus one. So you can move a three. But. And then he wants to create an. Yeah, he's doing melee style here. So. Yeah. Uh, He'd have to go. Ooh. Yeah. He'd have to go beside the bear. This way, right? Yep. And then it creates a trap here. Yeah. So there is a. What do they draw? A four damage trap and an adjacent empty hex closes to an enemy. And then he consumes whatever and turns into fire. Okay. All right. All right. And you are 23. So 21. So living corpse. Move plus one. Muddle and immobilize. Target one adjacent enemy. So number one will go first. He can move a three. One, two, three. Okay. Nobody does. These guys are going before me. That's nuts. I did not expect that. Uh, so number four doesn't need to move. He's going to muddle. And I'm, really? Did you play a big move again? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't realize those guys would go so soon. I didn't realize they had that. That yeah. sucks. So muddle and immobilize. That's yeah. awesome. Okay. Wow. That's number four. That just means like turns longer for you because you're close to whatever is going on in this room and I'm still stuck yeah. here now for another turn and this room's long. So well, I'm... hopefully I can just pitch some yeah, cards. I don't you know. Survive. We'll hopefully. See. Oh man, that's, um, that's rough. Okay, and then that guy up there is going to go number six. Yep. He can move of three. One, two, three. Okay, so he took six damage. Yep. On number six. Yep. So that kills him. Oh, sweet. And then that goes on the fire. Yep. Okay. Uh, now you at 23. And you can't move, so. Wow. Uh, yeah, so I was just going to heal anyway, so I don't care about this muddle business. Okay. I think that's the right call. Sure. There you go. And I lose my mobilize and muddle, so I'll just heal five, gain experience. Uh, that puts me up to 22. Okay. Okay. Uh, oh, I want to get two cards back. I might as well get one of the ones that just got burnt. Yep. Okay, you good? Well, this is used up. Okay. All right, so me at 26. I'm going to take a wound to one. Okay. Okay, then oh, I'm going to heal two, range three, target two, but you're too far. So I'm going to heal myself so lose, two lose the wound and lose and the get wound. Two. Nice. Okay. And now I'm going to try really hard to kill that flame thing so yeah. that I can get another health. Yeah, for your necklace of teeth. Yes. 
And he's poisoned, so let's just see. So attack of four on the flame demon. Five. Okay, so he's definitely dead. Six. Yeah, so and he's definitely he's not dead. Retaliate on you. So no curse gets in, but that's fine. And I'll take a gold. That's fine. I just need, so now I'm at four. So flame demon okay. is gone. We'll just do that for now. Yep. May come back. May come back. And imps. Okay, okay. so elite imp is needs to move one to get in range okay. and he's going to attack you for minus one so for one two two and then he's poisoning you and cursing you great down to 20. okay and then the next guy is already in range of four so he's attacking you for one nothing okay, sweet. he doesn't have curse but you're already poisoned oh one for poison oh, okay 19. yep and that's everything Elements and shuffles. Okay. Good. Right. Yep. 17. 21. 37. 14. Mobilize. Wow. Oh, and 32. Oh my god. Okay. So 14 is first. Cave bear. Yeah. So the elite cave bear doesn't need to move. Attacks me for four. Three. And he's wounding me, so I have to pitch a card for that because I only have four. Mm, I think I should open that door earlier. I just ran in. There was only one turn earlier that I would have been able to do it, but I needed to heal myself because I had the wound and I only had two health. True. Well, no, I mean the time when you were like wasted that one movement to open the door. Like you chose not to. You said stop at four instead of five movement. Oh, yeah. That's when I think you should have opened the door. Yep, yeah, and I'm immobilized. Uh -oh. Okay. Uh, that's it for me. 17 myself. Yep. Uh, the other bear need to move? Or? Oh, yeah. Sorry, sorry. Okay, so the other bear is move, move up minus one, so up three. to three. One, two. That's the same. Yeah, so. Oops. Doesn't move. Okay. Yeah, sure. And now you, sorry. Okay. Um, all right, we're gonna use boots. We're gonna do a move five. We're gonna do some jumping. One, two, three, and spawn the next room with two movement left. All right, so we got the room spawned up. Uh, behind these giant pieces of cardboard, we got the pressure plate, seven money, some two stone golems. Uh, they have shield 2, 12 health, 2 move, 4 attack, no range. And they're going to 83, move plus 0, attack minus 1, target all adjacent enemies, which is not bad. So you want to stay there if you don't want to get attacked by them? Uh, no, they can move 4, right? Or, oh, just oh, two. 2. yeah. But do I care? Well, these guys are not moving. So right where you are, you're safe from everybody. Mm. Except for the imps. Hmm. But it's up to you. These guys are attacking for three. So we got two more moves, right? Mm-hmm. I need to get to that pressure plate. Like, it's only... Sure. I don't know. I'm just, like, hoping you'll open the door and it's... No. Well, I'm immobilized. I'm not moving. Yeah, but... But I can try to next round. If you're... Yeah, I can try to next round. To attack me. I got one, two, three, four. Just need to go on that pressure plate. Um. Hmm. It's interesting if I stay there, they move up. Because I'll move up. One, two. And then one, two, so it'll still be the same problem. Okay, I'll go there. I'll pitch a card, get two experience. Oh, it's an attack. 
Never mind. I got to attack to stun. One, two. Yeah, I can't get close enough. Oh, I see. Yeah, he'll move. Oh, he moves first. And then he moves. Yeah. Either way, unless you stay where you were. Is the only way you're not taking attacks. Yeah. Okay. So I'm just going to burn to move then. Uh, that stinks. Okay. Uh, and then this will just do nothing. You can't shield yourself if you don't move? No. Because uh, I, I already did the bottom of one oh, card. Oh, I so see. You can't do two yeah. bottoms. Nope. I didn't realize you did the bottom. <laughs> All right. That's it for you? Yeah. Um, me at 21. You were 17, right? Uh -huh. Okay, so can I, if I can't move, can I still shield myself one? Yeah. Okay. It's, it's the same font size. So uh, it's like a step you could skip this line item and do that line item. I don't think it's going to matter, actually. I would still do it. But I'm still going to do it, yeah. And then I will do, oh, I got to take a wound. And I'll do an attack of four, range three. I'll do it with disadvantage on the bear, creating wind. So attack of four, minus one. I'm poisoned, so it's the minus one, so attack of three. So you got 15 out of 21. Three. Okay. Mobilize is gone. And that goes there. I'll leave that there. Okay, 32 corpses. They're only attacking if they're beside anybody, and they're not. Nobody and is they suffer beside. Damage. And then they all suffer damage, so. This guy goes to six. Number four goes to one. And number one goes to one. And now imps. So elite imp, is he within range four? One, two, three, four, yeah. Okay, he's attacking you for two. Okay. One. Uh, one damage, and I get a curse. Yep. We are almost out of them. Nice. There's three more in there, which means there's like seven in your deck. That's great. <laughs> <laughs> That's not funny. Okay, and then the other guy, is he within range four? One, two, three, four. Nope, so he can move of four. So you could do... One, two, one, two, three, four. He's attacking you for two. Nothing. Nice. Okay, and now the stone golems are just going to move of two and target all adjacent enemies. Nobody. Okay, that's it. Okay, and elements and shuffles. If you can do. I'm going to short rest, sorry, just in case. I'd rather have all my options possible. That's perfect. In case I have to pitch cards. So I'm going to play my highest move and see if I can just get there. And then just stay on my ground on it. Uh, okay, so let's do a short rest. Good. 26. 37. 43. Don't see mobilize. 28. Show me mobilize. No. Okay. 13. Beautiful. Oh, 13. Bear, that's quick. That's fine. And 82. That's okay. I got cards to pitch anyway. So 13 is first. Uh, I am 26. Yep. Yep. Okay. So he doesn't need to move. He's attacking me for four. Nothing. Yeah. Yes. The curse going through. Okay. The other yes. bear. Yes. And I'm already uh, wounded. Move uh, five. Move a four. Five. Yep. Yep. Sorry. One, two, three, four, five. So he's going to take. Sorry, how many are those? Uh, three, three damage. Okay, bear number one. Okay. Okay. And then that's bear at 13. Yep. Uh, 26. Minus. Yep. You're next. Yep. And then the golems. Oh, okay. Golems are moving as much as they want and they'll suffer damage. No, they're moving. Yeah, moving three. They're only 12 health. They got a shield. But if you can just get there yeah, and then do. just, Take the I'm going to see what happens when I open right, that door. So I'm going to do an attack five, range three, but I'll hawk helmet to range four. I'm going to shoot at this elite imp sure. for five. Muddling it. Okay. Muddling it. Piercing its shield. That's wonderful. And plus one. Oh, no. It's a six. Oh, no. And a minus one. Okay, so, so it's five, back to five. Five, uh, five so seven, pierce, eight. Kills him, yeah, right? he's dead. Okay, so you have gold. I'm just tired of this guy chasing me. So uh, that was this one. Off there, yeah. So 
one imp left. Okay. Uh, that was that generating sun, and then I'll just move five. One, two, three, four, five. Mon pressure plates. So you need to get to yours, <laughs> and we win. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try. All right. Uh, stone golems. You're done your turn. Yeah. Okay, stone yep. golems can do a move of three. So number three will go first, and I cannot see one, two. Yep. Attack you for four. Okay. Five, six, seven with poison. Seven with poison. All right, down to 11. And then he's going to suffer one damage. Great. And then the other guy moves up. Yeah. Attacks for four. 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 Uh, and then he suffers. Uh, five with poison. Seven, down to six. And then number four. Okay. And now me? Stone Golem is 28. Yep. You're 37. 37. Yep. Okay. And then you. So I am going to do a move of five. I'll do one to get on the door, leaving four All left. Right. Let's see what happens in this room. So one move already. Yeah, All four right, let's left. Spawn the room. All right, so we got the room spawned up. We actually have a treasure chest here in the back, two pieces of gold. We have the pressure plate we're looking for, and that stone golem also in the last room here. You have four move left. Yeah, but I forgot to take a wound at the start of my turn, so oh. I'm just going to do that to two. Okay. One, two, three, four. Okay, let me just think. How from, much move did you have? Five. I, yeah. Okay. So I could Treasure get. Chest, I could eh? get there. Think if you can survive one more turn. If, I know. I think I can because I have enough cards to pitch. So I goals. still have in my hand four cards. So you can get the chest and that pressure plate. Plus, I could technically long rest and get one of these back. So I would still have. Long yes. rest and survive. I mean, short rest. Sorry. Short rest. Okay. So if I better. played two, I would still have three cards in my hand to pitch. Yes, I think I'd be okay. Hold on. You play these. Gets you to the chest. Yep. You short rest to get one back. Yep. Which leaves you with five cards. Yeah, but I'm playing two. I have three, three in my hand to, for... For two bears and a stone golem attack. Which is enough. Assuming the bear doesn't... Oh, you will be here. So yeah, the bears won't get to you and... But once I'm on... You. Yeah, you'll be too far from the bear. Right? Bear, one, two, three, four... No, five. They but it's get, fine. Not the other guy. Immobilize you. You can go early and immobilize you, maybe. And that would stick you there. That's the only thing. If the bear was on your pressure plate, I don't think so. They have. I don't know how many mobilized cards they have. Even that is only a move four, though. If it's exactly oh, the okay. same, he okay. wouldn't be able to get me. Okay. Okay, we're gonna try. Let's try. <laughs> Let's try. Oh, I don't ever get chests. Let me try. No, I, I want to get the chest because like. I don't right want to play it again. I know. I don't either. I think. I, I think we got it. All right. Let's okay. Try. So let's do a move to the chest. One, two, three, four. I'll just look at what the chest is. To see if it matters right now. Uh, otherwise, I won't spoil it. I don't know which number is it. Forty-seven. Uh, nope, nothing that matters right now. So no spoilers. Okay. okay. Now I'm gonna do an attack of four, range three, create wind on the stone golem. Nice. You're not. Five. Five on stone golem. Stone golem. Yeah, shield of two. two. Oh. So three on number two. Three on number two. Okay. So he needs nine more to die. Okay. That was me. So now 43 the imps. Yep. So they're just one imp and he can move a four. One, two, three, four on and the door. And then he cannot get you range one, four. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, nope. you're good. Okay. And then... Here, we'll do the stone golem. Oh, sorry. That stone golem just needs to go after I open the door. So, oh, yeah. But it won't affect what just happened here. Yep. So he goes, moves... Uh, whatever he needs to to get you. Yep. And, and then he'll attack and suffer damage. Okay, and he's attacking me for four, right? I can't see. Sorry. Uh, attack of four. Yep. Four. So I'm going to pitch a card for that. Yeah, did you know that was coming? Are you ready for that? Attack here? Oh, man. Did we so, miscalculate? I don't know. So no, I think I'm okay. Next. Yeah. Okay, and then the corpse. corpse. Says, uh, so one. move of one only. One. Uh, so are they coming? Oh, yeah, they're, yeah, they're the coming way, back right? now. Yeah. Uh, but this guy can't get any closer because yeah. this guy's blocking him. Yeah. And then this guy will move one. Okay. Oh, so there's traps here too. So, will so they now just... they just decide, right? Like they go. So you're for... still closer. So yeah, they'll just so jump on a trap, suffer six. We'll go on a trap, popping it six. Who is that? Number. Number four. Number four. So he's gonna get a six. And then the other guy, he's made a path for his buddy. Okay, that's it. Elements and shuffles, and let's see. I'm gonna short rest just so I can have that other card. Okay. 
don't think it matters. Yeah, you just need to do a move. Stone Golem doesn't... But I'm going to go as early, early, early yeah, as I can. Yeah, before the Stone Golem immobilizes you. <laughs> All right. Good? Yep, 17. 21. Imp, 76. Stone Golem. Oh, my God, mobilized, but I'm going first. <laughs> wow. Oh, my God. 41 and 91. Okay. So you did 17? Yeah. Okay, you're first. All right. So Stone Golems are... Move, attack, Pulling and immobilizing. Oh, well, it's going to end once I get on it, right? Yeah, I think so. But they're, they're not going to pull me anywhere because I'm already close to them. Oh, I was talking about the guy by me. Oh, but they'll move back, right? So they don't get... Yeah. 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 But they're not going to go before I'll get there. Yeah, true. Hmm. Yeah. So under the assumption that 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 as soon as you do it, because the goal is occupy both pressure plates, a simultaneously. I'm assuming that ends it, but I'm afraid we might have to play with the round. I'm not sure, guys. Let us know in the comments below. I think we're gonna just end it when we hit the goal, but if we're doing that wrong, let us know in the comments. But if I if I knew it was gonna end it, I would just move back one so that the third one would attack me and pull me oh but then the other one would pull again mm -hmm. but it's only a pull oh it's a pull of two and then immobilize yeah so i will just but i think it's over once we yeah true okay so i'm just going to attack no. I don't know what to do here. I guess attack three and stun. Toss a card. I'll do it on number f uh, Who's got a hit? Three and four. Both the same. Mm -hmm. So attack three, stun, gain two experience. Uh, number three. Plus one is four. Shield of two. So number three gets two more damage and he's stunned. And then I will just toss this card for nothing. Okay. And so here are three cards in my hand. Okay, and then me. So yeah. I take a wound at the start of my turn to one. I will do this. I'll do a move of one to the pressure plate, creating darkness. Then I will do at disadvantage an attack of three, range three, create wind, get two experience. And throw this card away. So attack of three on the golem with disadvantage. So attack of two. He's got shields. Doesn't matter. And this card gets thrown away. And that's it. Now we're both on the plates. All right. So I think that's it. Um. Yeah, we did it. Wow. That's messed up. That was messed up. So much immobilize in these guys' decks. Yeah. I feel or like every character, every enemy they picked has immobilize. Does a screw with you? All right. Uh, so let's read the conclusion. Uh, from opposite ends of the network, you activate the switches in order to show, in the order shown to you by the voice. And as quickly as it came, the alarm subsidized and the wall of rooms open, leading you back to the entrance. There, in the center of the floor slides away, revealing a narrow ladder descending down into the dark. The way to the tomb is clear, the voice says. Go now and retrieve what is mine. And we actually open the new location, Time War, Time Worn Tomb 41, and the global achievement of ancient technology. Hmm. So it is linked to the Time Worn Tomb 41. So, so we like can we go right to it if we want, uh, without going back to Gloomhaven, avoiding road events and that yeah. kind of business. Uh, but yeah, that's it, guys. That's a crazy one. Uh, let us know if we made any rules, goofs, uh, in the comments. Really appreciate it. Uh, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, hit that little alarm bell button beside the subscribe button if you want to be notified when the next videos go up. I uh, appreciate it. If you guys want to donate to help offset the cost of this YouTube business, uh, you can do so by hitting the link in the description below. Uh, head on over to Patreon. Either way, thanks a lot for watching, guys. We'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.